Welcome back to Fish and More. In today's video, we're taking a closer look at the Windelov Fern, an easy, low maintenance plant that can bring life and beauty to your aquarium. If you're looking for a unique plant that's great for both beginners and experienced aquarists, this is the one for you. Before we dive in, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share this video with your fellow aquarium enthusiasts. Now, let's get started. 1. Introduction to Windelov Fern The Windelov Fern is a beautiful variant of the classic Java Fern, known for its finely divided, lace-like leaves. It's scientifically named Microsorum teropus, Windelov, and it gets its distinct look from the way its leaf tips fan out into multiple thin, delicate segments. Native to Southeast Asia, this plant is loved by aquarists for its hardiness, low light tolerance, and unique appearance. Whether you're keeping a large aquascape or a small nano tank, Windelov fern fits in perfectly. 2. Ideal tank setup. Windelov fern is incredibly easy to care for and thrives in a wide range of conditions. It doesn't need a special substrate. Since it's an epiphyte, it grows best when attached to driftwood, rocks, or other surfaces using thread or aquarium safe glue. Tank size. It can thrive in tanks as small as 10 gallons but it's also a great addition to larger aquariums. Lighting. It does well in low to medium light conditions. Too much light can lead to algae growth on its leaves, so avoid overly intense lighting. Water parameters. Keep the water temperature between 68 to 82 degrees Fahrenheit, 20 to 28 degrees Celsius, with a pH range of 6.0 minus 7.5. This plant can tolerate a variety of water hardness levels, making it ideal for most freshwater setups. 3. Planting and Placement One key to successfully keeping Windelov fern is ensuring its rhizome is not buried in the substrate. The rhizome is the horizontal stem from which the leaves grow, and if buried, it will rot. Simply attach the rhizome to hardscape items, and over time, the plant will anchor itself. You can place it on driftwood or rocks in the midground for a natural look. Attach it to the background of your tank for a lush, green wall effect. Or, let it float in the water to create a more wild, untamed aesthetic. 4. Growth Rate and Propagation Windelov fern is a slow-growing plant, so be patient. Its growth rate can vary depending on your tank's conditions, but in general, it doesn't need constant trimming. However, if you notice any dead or damaged leaves, you can remove them to encourage new growth. To propagate Windelov fern, Simply cut off sections of the rhizome with leaves attached and attach them to a new location in the tank. Over time, baby ferns will also sprout from the tips of the older leaves. 5. Care Tips and Common Issues Algae Growth Like many slow-growing plants, Windelov fern can become a target for algae, especially under high light. Keeping light moderate and performing regular water changes can help control algae growth. Nutrient Requirements Windelov fern doesn't require CO2 injection and can survive in low-tech setups. However, occasional dosing with liquid fertilizers can promote healthier, faster growth. Tank mates, it's compatible with most freshwater fish, including shrimp, snails, and peaceful species like tetras and rasboras. Even herbivorous fish like goldfish tend to leave Windelov fern alone because of its tough, leathery leaves. 6. Best Aquascapping Uses Windelov fern is perfect for aquascaping. Its unique, lacy leaf structure makes it an ideal plant to create contrast against other broader leafed or fine leafed plants. It works well in a variety of aquascaping styles, whether you want a jungle like look or a more structured, clean appearance. Pair it with other slow growing plants like Anubius or Buses, or use it as a centerpiece in a minimalist tank. 7. Conclusion That's everything you need to know about the Windelov fern. It's a stunning, versatile plant that's easy to care for and will make a beautiful addition to almost any tank. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced aquarist, Windelov fern will thrive with minimal maintenance. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to the channel for more aquarium tips and guides. Thanks for watching, and as always, happy fishkeeping!